Hey everybody, today I'm going to lead you through the hardware setup of a Night Owl Wireless NVR System, or WNVR for short. Pay close attention to the on-screen text, which will provide some important tips. Now let's get started. Carefully open the box and remove the two inner boxes. One is for the WNVR and its accessories, and the other is for the camera and its accessories. Keep the camera accessories together and separated from the wireless NVR accessories. When deciding where to place your WNVR, locate a central spot in your home. By placing it in a central location, the cameras can be mounted within the device's wireless range. Now for the initial setup, it's best to place the WNVR close to your router, and it must be connected to a TV or monitor. Also, although these cameras wirelessly transmit video to the WNVR, they are not battery powered and must be powered using the included power adapters. The cameras have a wireless transmission range of up to 300 feet with direct line of sight. Proper placement of the wireless NVR in your home ensures you achieve maximum coverage. Take note of the types of obstacles that can interfere with the wireless signal. Let's get the wireless NVR connected to your TV or monitor, which must have a minimum resolution of 1080p and an open HDMI port. If your TV or monitor doesn't meet the minimum required resolution, a black screen or a no signal message will be displayed. Using the included HDMI cable, plug one end into the HDMI port on the back of the wireless NVR and the other end into the TV or monitor. Keeping your wireless NVR connected to the internet is optional, but connecting for the initial setup is extremely important. During the initial setup, a connected wireless NVR automatically updates to the most recent software version. Now keep in mind our tech support phone agents cannot assist you unless you're running the latest software version on your WNVR. If you still don't want to connect to the internet, you must manually update the software every time a new version is released. Follow the on-screen instructions to manually update the wireless NVR's firmware. Plug one end of the included Ethernet cable into the LAN port on the back of the WNVR. Plug the other end into your router. Now, if you don't have an open port on your router, you can use a network hub or switch. Now go ahead and plug the mouse into the USB port on the back of the wireless NVR. Attach the antennas to the back of the WNVR. Make sure to attach an antenna to each camera. Before installing the cameras in their final location, it's imperative to test all of them next to the WNVR. The last thing you want is to permanently mount a camera and then realize there's an issue. Plug each camera into a power supply cable and then into a socket, surge protector, or UPS. Make sure the cables are securely connected. And also the cameras are prepared to your wireless NVR. Connect the WNVR's power adapter to the rear of the WNVR and then plug the other end into a power strip, socket, or UPS. Once the wireless NVR is plugged in, the super cool Night Owl logo appears. Now, if your TV or monitor is displaying a no signal message, make sure that it's tuned to the correct input or source and that all cables are securely connected. And at this point, you should see all connected cameras appear on screen displaying their live view. Although keep in mind, it may take a few minutes for the live view to appear. Finally, let's test the camera's night vision. We can do that by cupping our hands around the camera and then the camera's live view will turn to black and white. Again, test each camera. The startup wizard should appear on screen. Now the startup wizard leads you through the rest of the setup process. Navigate this slowly, paying attention to all of the details. If you don't want to connect to the internet, we recommend doing so for the startup wizard. This way you can use the free mobile app to check the camera's live view without running back and forth to the monitor. In this next section, we're going to demonstrate how to add and delete a camera. If an included camera is not paired, or you're adding a camera to the wireless NVR, please follow these next steps. Power on the camera using the camera power adapter. Depending on the camera model, either the camera says camera is in pairing mode or you'll hear a series of beeps. The status light then begins to flash quickly. If the camera is not in pairing mode, 
press and hold the reset button until you hear the camera say, camera is resetting, or it beeps. Now, using the included mouse, right-click on the screen, and then left-click on the menu icon. Enter your username and password. Now, if you don't know your password, click on Forget Password and follow the on-screen instructions. If you didn't provide an email address for password recovery during the start of Wizard, click the link below to go to the Password Reset tool on the Night Owl support site, and then return to this video. Once you're in the menu, left-click on the Camera tab, and then left-click on Add Camera. The camera may take up to three minutes to enter pairing mode. With the camera in pairing mode, left-click on Wireless Add. The wireless NVR searches for the camera. Notice that the bottom portion of the screen shows all cameras that are currently paired to the wireless NVR. Close the menu to see the camera's live view. It's important to note that you can only have as many devices as you have channels. In this example, the WNVR has eight channels. If all the channels are occupied, or if you're replacing a particular camera, you first need to open a channel. To do this, return to the camera tab in the menu. Left click the wireless channel the old camera is paired to, and then left click on delete. Now you can add a new camera or wireless device. For more information on your product, go to support.nightowlsp.com. Enter your device's series into the search bar to access support materials, including videos and troubleshooting articles. The series is listed on the device's support sticker, along with the component model number and the UID number. Our support site should always be your first choice when you need help with or have questions about your device. Thank you for watching and being a Night Owl customer.